Hi, I'm Alex Novikov, and I'm a Crow researcher at the University of Arizona, and now also Emory University. In this video, I'll walk you through running a script for metadata processing. The purpose of the script is to combine two spreadsheets with metadata that I used at a later stage to add headers and change file names. The script outputs a new spreadsheet with the data combined from the two existing spreadsheets. To help you run the script, we have provided a folder with test files. This folder contains uh, three files, two spreadsheets, one called, one called register file, and the other uh, is called uh, consented students file, and also a YAML file, uh, metadata.yaml. Uh, this is the register file spreadsheet. Uh, we get the spreadsheet from the registrar's office, um, and typically it contains information um, on all students from a given course. Um, as you can see, um, it has uh, student names, uh, their um, academic level, um, class section, um, uh, their registrar ID, college major, uh, etc. And um, Notice uh, the column uh, name uh, because uh, uh, the script uh, uses this column name. Um, I'll make this bigger. Uh, uses this column name uh, as an anchor uh, to combine this spreadsheet with uh, the other spreadsheet that I'm going to show you. Um, here is the other spreadsheet. Um, we call it Consented Students uh, Spreadsheet. And this spreadsheet uh, we uh, create ourselves and as you can see it has two tabs and the tabs have instructors names um, and uh, each tab contains um, um, information uh, about the students who consented for this particular instructor and uh, also notice that we have the uh, column uh, name um, as in the other spreadsheet that we'll be using as an anchor to combine these two uh, spreadsheets. Uh, so here's the YAML file, and the YAML file indicates that we have uh, two uh, spreadsheets, uh, so file one and file two, and that both of these spreadsheets um, have a column, um, a column that's called name, so as you can see. And um, uh, for example, if you wanted, if your column uh, names uh, are different, uh, you can go into the YAML file and, and change that right here. Actually, um, but make sure that your uh, the co the content uh, of your columns um, is is the same uh, between the be between the two spreadsheets, so that it can match uh, uh, by uh, by the column. And also, um, the YAML file also specifies that um, uh, one of the files has uh, tabs with instructor names. And you can also change that. All right, I think we're ready to run the script. So uh, let's navigate to the terminal. And let me make this uh, a little bigger. OK, so this is my terminal. And now we need to navigate to the folder uh, where you um, downloaded uh, your Chavada folder, which in my case is the desktop. So let's go to desktop. And the name of the Chavada folder is Chavada Master, uh, because I downloaded directly from the GitHub website. All right, so inside the Chavada uh, Master folder, as you can see, there's a bunch of other folders, and the one we need for this script is the metadata prep. So let's navigate there, metadata prep. And inside of that, there should be um, the script um, and the folder with the test files um, that I uh, previously mentioned. So we have the two spreadsheets and uh, one YAML file. All right, so we are ready. So Python the name of the script, and then uh, let's specify all the arguments with all the test files. So file one, and remember that the files are inside of the test files folder, so you need to um, um, do the path here. So test files, then consented students, and then file two, Again, inside the test files, the registrar, 
um, file and then the YAML file also inside of test files and I think it's called metadata YAML yes all right we are ready so click enter and here we go uh, it told us that it was getting data from um, these two tabs and these are the instructor tabs so um, now let's double check that the script worked uh, so the script should have uh, created um, a new uh, spreadsheet um, uh, with uh, information uh, combined from the two spreadsheets uh, that we specified so let's go to um, uh, our folder so it's the Chabata master folder, uh, metadata prep. Yeah, and here we go. Uh, we have a new file called metadata um, ICSV, and let's uh, open it just to double check what it looks like. And here we go. Um, we have, as you can see, a new um, column called instructor name from the tabs, uh, the consented student uh, spreadsheet tabs, um, and yeah, all the information uh, from the registrar um, data. All right, uh, so the script worked. Um, thanks for watching.